Welcome back to the gym, guys. So pretty straightforward Tuesday training day. We've got an interval piece and we have an after party, okay? Um, the interval piece, let's get right into it. It is a six rounder and it happens every three minutes. You'll get lots of built-in rest if you're doing it right. Um, three movements, they're all the same for all the rounds. There is a twist after round three, which I'll get to shortly, okay? so. What we're doing, single dumbbell, we're going 10 goblet lunges, we're going 10 single arm renegade rows, so that'd be <coughs> five on each side. And then we are doing 10 single arm thrusters, again, five on each side, okay? <coughs> That's rounds one through three. <coughs> Sorry, so I got my cough. <coughs> rounds one through three. At round four, We'll do the same exact things, except for we'll switch the order. So now it's 10 one-arm thrusters, still 10 renegade rows as your second exercise, <laughs> and 10 goblet lunges, okay? So let's cover kind of timing for each of these things. Each movement should take no longer than 30 seconds, about 30 seconds or so, meaning we'll get done with a round in a minute and a half, and we'll have therefore a minute and a half of rest okay that being said we do want you to challenge yourself with that dumbbell weight ideally you're using the same dumbbell but if one movement is significantly weaker than the other it's totally fine to use different dumbbells we do want it to progress in such a way that you're not getting a minute and a half maybe by round four of work maybe it's bleeding into a minute 45 shouldn't ever take more than two minutes but it, this is one of those workouts where it's all right if you're starting to go a little bit slower as you get through this, as you progress through this workout, as you progress through the six rounds, okay? That being said, just to reiterate, it should never take longer than two minutes, but challenge yourself a little on this one, okay? So our after party is three sets for quality. It's eight tempo goblet squats. The tempo is gonna be a three count going down, no pause at the bottom, three count going up, no pause at the top, okay? so. This can be as light or as heavy as you need to as long as you're holding technique. These after parties are often for improving certain qualities, and this would be squat mechanics, of course. Then we're going to do a one-minute plank hold, and then we're going to go 10 um, box step-ups. Okay, You can use that same dumbbell, or it can be unweighted, whatever the case may be. That would be five on each side, alternating. Okay, I like to pick, when I'm doing these, I like to pick a box height that is about knee level or if you have to go one way or the other a little bit below knee level. That's it for today's training. Hope to see you soon. Out.